Some of you guys right, might remember that uh, last year I did a video talking about this man, John Cundla, the original uh, head coach for the Lakers franchise back when they were still in Minneapolis. Uh, when he, uh, he celebrated, and most of us celebrated and acknowledged his 100th birthday. Um, just a few weeks ago, July 3rd, uh, John Cundler celebrated his 101st birthday, and he was the oldest uh, living uh, member of the Naismith Memorial Basketball Hall of Fame. Sadly today, uh, John Cundler died at age 101 in a nursing home in Minneapolis. And um, I guess you can't be uh, too sad for a person that lived to be that long. Born in 1916, um, he accomplished much in his life. Um, he became the head coach of the Minneapolis Lakers when he was only 31 years old. Uh, shortly after his uh, arrival as head coach, the team acquired George Mikan and the rest was history. They won one title in 1948 in, I believe, the NBL, uh, and then five titles in the NBA, uh, the league's first dynasty, and he was the head coach of that team. And his name is very rarely mentioned among the great coaches of all time. I hear about, of course, Phil Jackson and, and Pat Riley, uh, Red Auerbach, of course, Red Holtzman, uh, Lenny Wilkins. But you never hear the name John Cundler. And uh, John Cundler quit the NBA as far as coaching when he was still a very young man. By coaching standards, he was only 40, how old was he at the time, 43. Uh, he did not want to leave Minneapolis. The team was relocating to the Lakers. And despite the fact the team had acquired all-star Elgin Baylor, and ultimately they would get Jerry West as well, uh, he didn't want to leave the Minneapolis area. And he stayed there. And I believe he became the head coach of the of University of Minnesota, a, a, a franchise I always remember, uh, not a franchise, but a, a program that ultimately produced um, one of my favorite players to watch when I was growing up, even though I caught the tail end of his career, uh, Kevin McHale. Um, but today we lost a legend. And I have to say, rest in peace to John Cundler. And uh, uh, my sympathy uh, goes out to his friends and family and loved ones. John Cundler, uh, dead at age 101.